Okay, using the Taylor Service Complete Test Kit, um, I'm going to be showing you how to test your cyanuric acid. Um, important you have cyanuric acid in the pool. It's what, at least if it's an outdoor pool, um, because it keeps the ultraviolet rays from causing your chlorine to dissipate uh, super quickly. So it's kind of a sunblock for your chlorine. Uh, if you don't have it in there on a nice hot sunny day, you'll put a gallon of chlorine in and it'll be gone the next day. So important that you have this in there if you have an outdoor pool. Um, okay, first thing you want to do is you want to fill your... Um, comes with a little vial here. You want to fill it up to the first line um, with uh, just your water out of the pool. And then um, I've got the uh, R0013 cyanuric acid reagent. What we're going to do is we're going to fill up the vial until it's uh, up to the next line. So basically it's half water, half of the reagent. And then you shake it up. It's like 30 seconds and then it's just really important that you um, check this probably I would say twice a year two or three times a year you don't have to check it all the time but um, it is important uh, if you have too much in there it actually can damage your plaster and it can prevent your chlorine from working properly you want it to be to be between oh I would say 40 and 80 parts per million uh, salt chlorinated pools usually you recommend I recommend that you keep it closer to 280 on a basic chlorinated pool with a liquid or a tablet you want to probably keep it around 40 or 50 so once you've shaken it up for about 30 seconds um, we're just gonna fill the vial up um, normally you just fill it up until you can't see that white that black dot at the bottom it doesn't look like we actually have um, enough cyanuric in this pool to register so we that means we probably have only about maybe 20 parts per million I know we have some but I think um, they drain the pool for some reason so I'm gonna have to add some more cyanuric but anyway um, that's testing the cyanuric acid. Um, it's a pretty simple test. So, um, hope you guys can use it. Thanks.